please click on the subscribe button and press the bell icon for watching more update videos hello everyone once again and welcome to my channel please don't forget to subscribe into my channel and press the bell icon for watching more update videos so now i'm going to solve the member at join c now so at join c so we know the angle he has 50 degrees and he has we have the angle of 40 degrees which we have found already so now i'll take summation of fx which is equal to zero i have positive 60 kilonewton 60 minus bc i have minus cf cosine of 50 degrees yeah and i have positive why did why, why did i take positive because if you look here in this direction cosine is a positive yeah so that's why i take this in this direction cosine is a positive so plus cd cosine of 40 degrees do you have any other force acting at that horizontal direction no therefore it is equals zero okay and the next step i'll take summation of f y that will be equal to zero so i have minus c f sine of 50 degrees minus c d sine of 40 degrees minus c e And that will be equal to zero. So at join C, we have three unknowns, yeah? C, F, C, E, C, D. So therefore, we can't solve it now. So let's move to join E and then uh, to join D. So once I find out the join D and then I'll go back, I'll come back to join. So now I'm going to solve the members at join D first because we have two unknowns. And then we'll go back to join C. So we know this angle is 50 degrees. So summation of fx equals zero. I have minus ed minus cd cosine of 50 degrees. That will be equal to zero. Next step, take summation of fy equals zero. I have positive 30, say 1.3 plus CD sine of 50 degrees, and that will be equal to zero. So first, I'm going to find out the member, uh, the member of my CD, and then I can find the members of member of ED. So the CD will be equal to minus 30 say 1.3 divided by sine 50 and that will be equal to minus 30 say 1.3 divided by sine 50 that will be equal to minus 48.69 kilonewton that's the compression that's the value of my cd so now i'm going to find out the value of my ed so the ed move it to another side it will be a positive equal to minus cd cosine of 50. so my ed will be equal to so i have so my CD is minus 48.69, yeah? So minus one minus cancel each other. So it'd be a positive 48.69 cosine of 50 degrees. So the ED will be equal to 48.69 cosine of 50 degrees. And that will be equal to 31.2 
3.0 kilo newton and that's a tension yeah so now we will go back to joint C so now I know the value of my CB and the value of my CD so as unknown so I, I don't know the value of my CF and CE so I know the value of my BC and I know the value of my CD so I'm going to find out the value of C first and then I can find out the value of my CE okay so first I'm going to find out the value of my CF I'll move my CF to another side to become positive so CF cosine of 50 it will be equal to 60 minus BC plus CD calls 40 degrees yeah so my CF will be equal to so I have 60 minus what is the value of my BC so the value of my BC is minus 2.67 yeah so minus minus will cancel each other it become positive 2.67 yes so I have plus CD so what is the value of my CD so the value of my CD so the value of my CD is here yeah the value of my CD is minus 48.69 yes so become a minus 48.69 cos 40 and all divided by cosine of 50 so my CF will be equal to put 60 60 plus 2.67 minus 48 48.69 cosine of 40 all divided by cos 50 and that will be equal to 39.47 kilo newton and that say what tension so i know the value of my cf now so now i'm going to find out the value of my ce so i have minus c here i'll move it another side would become a positive ce so positive c will be equal to minus cf sine 50 minus cd sine 40 so my ce will be equal to i have what is the value of my cf which is minus 39.47 sine 50 minus cd what is the value of my cd which is 48.69 minus 48.69 so i have minus minus will, will be a positive so plus 48.69 sine of 40 so the CE will be equal to minus 39.47 sine of 50 plus 48.69 sine of 40 degrees and that will be equal to 1. 0 0.6 I'll take it at 1.1 kilonewton that's a tension and thank you guys for supporting me and watching my videos if you have any question regarding this example please comment below and I'll reply as soon as possible